Hello, welcome to SAP Math Introduction. Today I'll be going over the course curriculum and some basics. Before we get started, what is SAP Math? SAP Math stands for Singapore Math. Singapore Math is a teaching method used to learn and master fewer mathematical concepts at greater detail, as well as learning these concepts using a three-stage learning process, concrete, pictorial, and abstract. Some background about Singapore math. This teaching method was based on Singapore's Ministry of Education National Primary Mathematics Curriculum and is used from grade one through six. Singapore math success started in 1995 when Singaporean children shocked the world with their first place score on an international math test. And the rest is history. So how does Singapore math work? Singapore math presents each math concept in three different stages. The first stage is using hands-on objects. The second stage is using pictures. And the third stage is using written symbols. Singapore math calls this the concrete, pictorial, abstract approach. So let's take finding the area of a rectangle as an example. First, children will create a physical concrete rectangle out of blocks. Then they'll draw the rectangles in a 2D format and look at pictures in the textbook. Last, they'll learn the abstract formula, which is length times width equals area, and they will use that to solve problems without using manipulatives or any visuals. Singapore math focuses on teaching math in a logical order. The course teaches every concept purposefully and step by step so students can gradually develop a solid conceptual understanding. They'll be learning not just how to do math, but also why what they're doing works. The two main focuses in this course are mental math and word poems. SAP provides children lots of practice with basic pencil and paper computations, but the program also focuses on developing kids' mental math and word poem skills. Mental math is more than just solving problems mentally. It also helps students build a strong number sense and a deeper understanding of the properties of numbers, so it's an important part of the course. Singapore Math also uses hands-on materials and pictures to help children tackle an often difficult part of elementary math, which is word problems. The course presents a greater variety of word problems than most other elementary math programs and teaches kids how to apply their math skills to a wide variety of situations. Once students reach third and fourth grade level books, they'll learn to draw bar models to represent and solve word problems. These models help prepare them for algebra and think about the structure of problems beyond the surface level. Singapore math may be a great fit for your child if your child thinks logically and likes math presented in a clear, straightforward way, or if your child likes a mix of hands-on and paper-pencil learning, if your child needs improvement on understanding word problems and mental math, or if your child is a visual and audible learner. And thank you for watching.